God is good. God is good. When you believe upon the word, you got all the riches you need. Amen. Because the richness is in the word of God. Only through God shall you, only through Jesus you shall get to God. You know? So you're so filled with the Holy Spirit and you're praising the Lord and they you're not in one. the best of a situation right now. You yep. don't have a big fancy house and you got yep. a shopping cart here. Yep, this girl is telling me, uh, oh, they said, I'm a millionaire because I give to charity. I says, well, it's more blessed to give than to receive. Amen, brother. You know, if you give, you sow a good crop, you get a good return. You know, you got to sow a little and you got to reap a little. Amen, brother. If you sow a lot, you get a lot. You sow nothing, you lose what you got even. You know, he says, that's why the poor man will will have nothing, but the rich man will get richer. But richness is in the word of God. It's not in the billfold. <laughs> right. It's not the cash value of it. It's a spiritual belief that you have in the word of God. Amen. Oh, you know, one that has the wisdom of the Lord is, is much richer than the guy that got a million dollars. That's right. I mean, you know, the guy can have a million dollars in 10 or 12 houses, but they ain't got the word of God. They ain't worth nothing because it's all going to dust. You know, we're all just dust in the wind if we don't believe in the word of God and, and put our hearts, let our hearts be open unto the Lord. Because he knows the hearts and men, the, the minds of men are pure evil. You know? Our kingdom is still to come. We haven't got there yet. Yeah, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Your riches are stored up in heaven. Amen. What about Christians, Christians today that God. are just living in the material world and what kind of, how they can now do their well, neighbor? It, it don't matter what you do in this world except for that you love thy brother is I love myself well, a lot of them love their self but they won't help their brother like someone in right. need like yourself they won't stop and they won't offer to even pray well you gotta try yeah. you're, you're gonna fall every time when, when, when you put your trust in men but when you put your trust in the Lord you shall never fall Amen. because God never falls you know he fell for three days he was in in the pits of hell for three days and then he was raised back up and if we believe in the word of God we are raised back up with him Amen. through the resurrection of Jesus Christ Amen. from the cross to the grave that we shall be saved if we believe upon the word of God Amen. in John it says that I'm in the word the 17th time reading the Bible yeah, you can read the Bible well, all what, your life and not comprehend all the intention of God because right. his, his thoughts are way above ours. You know, we can't Amen. reach the, the outer limits of the Lord because there is no limitations when God is involved. Amen. God, God can do anything he wants to do, you know, and nobody can stop him. Right. The, 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 devil tried and he was cast out he of heaven tried. <laughs> because the god the devil wanted to be god but he's always tried to outsmart god he never could right. even with job he never you know? could look what job went through I, I feel like job because i got too much from head to toe and i'm still kicking and going you're still I'm, praising the lord I, I may curse the day i was born but i'll ne ne never give up my integrity in the lord's word Amen. Can we all say a prayer together? Let's say the hour. Amen. Why don't you guys gather around? Lord, I hope we all have a personal relationship with Jesus. Amen. That we might go on to the Father as being holy, for we serve a holy God unto a holy people, that we shall be saved through Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 And amen. God bless you, brother. That's all.